Hey collective, how you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing well. I am up. I've been up since 4 o'clock this morning. Can't sleep. I said, let me come into my terror room and do a quick little see what's going on. What spirit needs you guys to know? Um, I've called in the appropriate protection. It is a timeless reading. It's whenever I find you. I was up this morning because um, I was thinking about my son. Gabby has seen him at the gas station asking for money around 10 o'clock at night. So that's telling me that he never went to the shelter. And so happens, it's snowing out here. And I was talking with Gabby and he was telling me that um, Jason was showing him batteries, all the batteries that he got. I'm like, oh Jesus, why? So naturally, you know, as a mom, I'm going to worry. It's, it's, we're under a warning, a snow, um, snowstorm warning here. It's cold. It's snow and ice, seven to 10 inches. And my son is outside. <sighs> Far away places. Get ready for a new horizon, Spirit said. So, some of you guys may be moving. Some of you guys may be thinking of moving. Some of you guys, um, you're about to go far, like, you know, whatever this is, whether it's a project, it's a job, it's a, it's a new location, Spirit said, get ready for new horizons because you're about to be taken to faraway places. Some of you guys may have contracts overseas, I'm hearing. Um, your ships are on their way and they're filled with goodies. What else do we need to see here, Spirit? Discovering the truth. You stand in the light of truth. Some of you guys, you're meant to... Um, um, you're truth seekers, truth tellers. Um, for somebody here, your voice is about to take you far away places. Um, it's going to be heard international... People are going to be di directed towards you. Let's get one more. So if you guys are thinking about opening up a platform, you know, if you're doing something where it's like, I don't know, what else could, what else could, that type of a message be answering the call. Somebody's about to answer the call. The moment you answer the call and you stand in the light of truth, I feel like this is when all this goodness is coming. I see somebody getting mail. You know, um, talk show I'm hearing
You're not meant to be where everybody else is at. It's like spirit is guiding you in a different direction. You see how these people are being directed over here? They're asking for guidance. They're being directed over here, right? You are being directed this way. You're answering the call. You're following what it is that spirit is telling you to do. Outside. When I seen this card just now, I just heard step out the box. So I feel like you're stepping out the box. And whatever this box is that you're stepping out from, that you're walking out from, I feel like it's going to open up different doors to faraway places. You, I'm hearing you're going to meet fellow travelers along the way. You could also be a guide for other people, guiding people on their path. I heard mainstream. Um, the time is now. Yeah. Be strong, segment. Some of you guys may be um, scared to do this. Fearful of, um, I don't know. Why would you be scared to answer the call? I just seen the release card. So if you are feeling a little fearful, release it. Be bold, Freya. Be confident. If you get nervous, focus on service. <laughs> the time is now, Spirit is saying. Um, something with adventure, something with excitement, something with the new, something with the um, adventurous side of you. Take risk, be daring, Spirit said. You're stronger than you think you are, and your strength assures a happy outcome. Some of you guys may have been indoors too long. It's time for you to go outside and get some fresh air. Take a trip. On a favorite rocket ship, planet, mm, mm, mm. little Einstein's. Climb on board. Da, 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 little Einstein. What can we get from this? I feel like once you step through this door, it's going to be a whole new world. You're going to be like, what? I heard set you apart. Um, some of you guys may have went through some kind of like ten of swords. I feel like whatever this was, okay, it was meant to set the course of you going through a rebirth. Um, the Ten of Swords is Gemini energy. This is like betrayal endings. But whatever this thing was, I feel like it's going to help you create whatever this thing is that you're creating. So you have a platform to speak about it. Death card. Death transformation. Rebirth.
you're gonna discover some kind of truth once you once you take the first step. You're gonna see that there's people like you. Um that you know needed needed your guidance that that your ex not your only your guidance but like your 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 experience you know yeah to help them transmute the energy transform themselves you know sometimes when we go through stuff and press energy right there what is that who's that who's that queen of wands Sometimes when we go through things, Spirit wants us to speak about these things because it helps other people see that they're not alone. It helps them see things from a different perspective, how they could overcome these things, right? Get out of their head. And just having a, a communication of being able to speak about stuff like that, that's dope. Like, I wish... I was able to do that, you know, like I had a place to go to and, and, and talk about shit. You know what I mean? When I was going through my path, um, my journey, you know, I'm still on my journey, but like in the beginning, like uh, <laughs> caller number nine. Yes. You're on air. <laughs> King of Pentacles. Um, the King of Pentacles is when we think about the King and the Queen of Pentacles. Though you think about home, work, physical health, you think about um, nurturing, commitments, dedicated. That's the ground chakra. That's the legacy. Starting new jobs. The safety, the stability, right? The essential foundation of one. Um, I feel like for whoever I'm reading for here, um, you can be, you know, either of these signs. Um, but what I'm feeling here is like, you're going to be able to help nurture and direct, like guide, direct people. Yeah, from past, poss you know, past 10 of, 10 of, get through this. You're going to help them get through this. Their past betrayals. Okay. You're going to help them see things different. Discover the truth to why they went through what they went through. You know what I mean? What they couldn't see. Okay? Give them a different perspective on things. And you're going to do it confidently. Queen of Wands. You're going to help people open up their mind to faraway places. Like where they... You're going to help people come out the box. Where they were in this box thinking one way. Right? Um, you're going to help them come out that box so that they can see why things were happening in their life is what I'm getting why things transpired why they went through you know constant endings why they went through betrayal um, you're going to help them figure out what their call is stand in their truth help them reach far away places the way you did it okay you could be guided to do um Guidance. Look it. I just said it. Guiding people on their path. The Hierophant is um, that's the spiritual guidance. Spiritual, traditional guidance. Um, the Hierophant is very tapped in. This is the highest of the high. Um. Yeah, look, you look at your guiding people. See those two people, they're looking up to you? 
They're going to be coming to you. You're going to you're going to drop the gems. See those two keys? Something that they couldn't people couldn't see before. You're going to help guide them. Mhm. Mm I can never make this up. People are going to be coming to you, paying you for your service. And you're going to point out, see that flashlight? You're going to point out what they couldn't see. Whether it's what they couldn't see or what they need to see. Okay? Because I don't feel like it's going to be in one spectrum. I feel like this is going to be a broad spectrum. You're going to help guide people to answer their call. You're going to help guide people to um, heal through betrayals, past traumas. I feel like this is going to be open. Um, yeah, this is a gift of yours. This is what you were meant to do. Help guide people. Help them walk this path. Drop the gem. What is the gem? That's the knowledge so that they can walk this path. Mm-hmm. I just seen the three of the three of wands. That's Aries energy. But the three of wands is talking about peace. It's a waiting period. It's um seeing things far out visions, right? Like seeing what does the future hold for me? Far away places, right? Um I'm also getting somebody stepping away from outdated traditions and programmings um, from their upbringing. This person, this young person is walking. They, they're not asking this, this grandma for guidance. This person, you would think that they don't have a lot of knowledge here. But they're not even going to that person. They're like, uh-uh, I can't follow you because you don't know the way. Ooh, shit. What the fuck? Mm. Mm-hmm. That's the truth. Be strong. That's going to be victory and sex. Victory and success. Okay. Um, if you get nervous, focus on service. Remember why you're answering the call. Remember why you're doing this. Okay. Um... I love you guys. This is what I have for you. So, yeah, if I were you, I would definitely start making the moves, start, you know, planning, writing things down, um, creating whatever you need to create, and just go for it, guys. Whoever this is for, if it's resonating, let me know. Like, share, subscribe to the channel. Um, you can also email me as well, um, Collective Love and Light.